With the fifth selection of the 2022 priority selection, Sarney Stinger pleased to select for the Toronto Junior Canadians, Porter Martone. We felt we were pretty fortunate that he was still there. Uh, you know, early on in the year when you're always scouting, you kind of start to look at players that you would be pretty happy if you could uh, bring them into your organization. And Porter was a kid that we'd kind of earmark. You know, we're excited. And it's a combination of, and I feel like I've said this a couple of times, but a combination of skill and size and leadership and character. Um, ability to score, um, you know, he, he gets, he's got to come from a fantastic family and, you know, hockey people. Um, so all of those, you know, tangibles go kind of culminate into one and we think we've got a pretty good player. So an exciting kid. Um, and I know our fans will be happy to see him here pretty soon. He just has that ability to find those loose holes in the offensive zone, right? And he's got a real nifty release. Um, you know, it's on an office stick, um, kind of the silky, silky to him that not a lot of big guys have um, and you know the knack for scoring big goals at big, uh, big times you know a couple big games uh, you know I can think Silver Stick that can go which will cup where he had a couple of, you know real big goals for his team and um, you know so it, it's not just the goal scoring like I mentioned he's a, he's a well-rounded kid plays both ends of the ice he's committed he's a student you know of the game if you get to know him you'll realize he really understands and certain nuances of the game that not many kids do. So, uh, like I said, full package, quite literally. The Sarnia Sting had the uh, next pick here in round number three, and they went to the Ajax Pickering Raiders. Uh, Daryl, uh, Sean Doherty, a center. I think initially throughout the year, our scouts, you know, we were, it was this competitiveness that we really liked early. You know, he obviously is a really good skater. He's a righty, um, but he plays hard on the puck. And... You know that was the, the the early indications that we were that we were you know there's something here with this player and as the season went on we saw his, his play really improved um, you know obviously at the end became really the, like you said the go-to guy in his club offensively but played in some key situations too um, yeah the competitiveness the skill the skating you know he's not he's not a huge player but we know with his off ice training and his commitments away from the rink he's going to be a strong kid and hard to knock off pucks and we like that style of his game Sarnia Sting making a choice here uh Carson Campbell the selection out of the uh, Quinty Red Devils he felt like he he kind of went uh he fell onto the radar a little bit with that team obviously a couple other defensemen went a little higher in the draft which we knew would would happen but with Carson you know he's a smooth skating right-handed defenseman really efficient makes makes good plays he's um, competitive we see some size we think there'll be some size there more so than what you see right now I mean um, you know the family there's some size there good kid from, a, from an unbelievable family as well so all of our background stuff we kind of figured we're gonna get a you know a player that may maybe as good or better than the other defensemen on his team um, just happened to play underneath them throughout the season you know um, uh, so committed to play in Sarnia we're excited to see him you know uh, see what happens come September yeah real smart player um, another guy that you know great team but maybe didn't get the love that he deserves as well intelligent got really good size and range reads the ice well um, you know another kid from a phenomenal family uh, he'll be he'll be in our uniform at some point I'm sure um, yeah it, we were that was a pick that we were pretty excited to make.